Hi guys, James Vickery here from I Know IT. Thanks for tuning in to I Know ITV. If you've been following on for a while, you've probably gathered that every now and then some of the big IT companies out there have been sending over some products for us to review. And today we're taking a new look at this HP micro server. Now I've reviewed this unit before or a similar unit before. However, HP are now promoting this product in what they call a blitz in a box. And well, what does that all mean? Firstly, if you haven't seen one of these before, I'll just quickly explain why they're making a bit of a splash in business. In the past, most organisations have had at least one server in their office, and perhaps even two or more servers, depending on the business requirements. But things are rapidly starting to change. For example, cloud computing has meant that some organisations don't need to have a server at all, opting to have all of their IT net needs met online. Others, however, are still in a bit of a transitional phase. That's where these systems come in. With a microserver like this, HP 2020T, businesses can reduce the amount of equipment in their office, thereby freeing up space, reducing power requirements, and consolidating the amount of hardware that your business needs to maintain. Although this box is pretty small, it packs a punch. Much like its larger predecessors, which were much, much bigger, these devices can hold quite a bit of storage, up to 12 terabytes, and they have some significant networking capability, meaning that they aren't just designed for small businesses. Now, if you want detailed technical specifications and benchmarks, marking type information, you're probably better to head to the HP website. For now, what I will say is that for certain applications, such as managing a small database, securing your business environment, or establishing branch offices for your company, these are definitely worth a look. They're calling this blitz in a box because not only does it meet various server requirements, it also has an add-on network switch. Now, I can't speak for the marketing slogans, but it's not a bad idea. HP are mostly known for their servers and desktops, but they've been quietly chipping away at the networking market for a few years now and this is an example where your IT people can quickly set up a small office for you without having to source technology from various vendors trying to make it all work together. Theoretically, it should also reduce the amount of time it takes to set up your business IT and that obviously has a number of cost saving benefits for you. Now, you're probably wondering what does this all cost? Well, that's really going to depend on your business requirements. You can, of course, pick up a basic model for less than $1,000, which is a great deal for anyone looking to set up an office or branch office on the cheap. But in reality, once you start adding storage, drives, memory, and server software, such as Windows Server 2012, then you're starting to get up there in price. So you really need to have a professional, such as the team at I Know IT, to scope this out properly for you to ensure it meets your needs. Technology really is changing. We're starting to see the impact of cloud on these manufacturers in that they need to make smaller, more affordable devices for business. And I think that this is a great start. So that's all from me. Of course, if you have any questions or we can be of any assistance at all, just give us a call on the number below and we look forward to hearing from you. Thank you.